Iliska Bistritsa lies at the crossroads of routes between Trieste, Rijeka and Ljubljana. Here you are only a step away from the top of Mount Snezhnik or the sea. Not surprisingly, its size makes the municipality rich in cultural and natural attractions. The top of Veliki Snezhnik, which offers a splendid view, is certainly the most noticeable. The top of Mount Snezhnik is protected as a botanical reserve. Several mountaineering routes lead to Snezhnik, with the most well-known path leading from Svišćaki. A mountain hut and sanctuary is situated on top, where visitors can recuperate and rest before heading back to the valley. A bit further down, Snezhnishka Planota, mostly overgrown with virgin forests, is still home to deer, wild boar, bears, wolves and even lynx. The tranquil mountain property of Mashun lies amidst the forests of Snezhnik. In addition to a myriad of sporting activities, visit the remains of the hunting castle, castle house and forest education trail. Picnics can be organized on Mashun and a local inn will cater for lovers of venison. Bike rental is available. The Svišćaki holiday settlement in the heart of Snežnik's forests is one of the starting points for the ascent to Snežnik. Rest in the Svišćaki mountain lodge and sample a wide array of local dishes. There are also plenty of sporting activities. During winter, Svišćaki operates a ski slope and there are attractive cross-country skiing tracks nearby. A mighty overhanging limestone rock wall rises above the village of Podtabor. Offering sanctuary to the oldest Primorska vine. The Podstenshek stream rises beneath and creates picturesque rock ridges as it flows. Iliska Bistritsa is the administrative and cultural center of the municipality. Its picturesque town center dates back to the 14th century, while the area has been populated since the Iron Age. The town hall, constructed in Venetian style, is one of the most beautiful town buildings, together with the early 20th century Schoenberg mansion. The nunnery of the Sisters of Notre Dame, Vencine House, and the remains of mills and sawmills, among which Hodnik Mill is the best known, complete the rich period architecture. The clustered hillside village of Prem in the heart of Burkini is a protected cultural monument. The central part of the settlement lies between the castle on one side and the parish church of St. Helena on the other side of the hill. A room is arranged in the former Prem school building devoted to the memory of Prem's native poet Dragotin Kete, a classic writer of the Slovenian modernist period. A medieval castle was built on the foundation of an ancient Roman fortress. It is composed of a two-story Romanesque palatium with a chapel and a Renaissance wall with a round tower at the entrance. It houses a permanent museum collection. The castle annually hosts a medieval market with jousting, medieval dancing and plays. On the other side of Prem lies the church of St. Helena. Constructed in pseudo-Romanesque style with pronounced Baroque characteristics, it is famous for its 1921 frescoes by painter Tone Kral.
Further to the northeast of the Ilirska Bystrica municipality lies the early 17th century Kautz Castle, significant for Slovenian national history. It was the home of the pro-Slovenian politician Miroslav Vilha, who in 1869 organized and housed the so-called Puka camp. Its participants expressed their demand for a united Slovenia. The elusive Reka Valley, with its rapids and pools, attracts people seeking recreation, fishing and photo hunting experiences. Find refuge from the heat of summer in the shaded Leto, or walk down the Kete path, which leads you along the Reka, past the Postovice Valley to Prem. Spend some time in the numerous hospitable homesteads, take a look at the renovated Novak Mill and stroll in the farm grounds of the Turn Mansion. Above the village of Novokracine, on the Yelshane Plain, rises a high elevation called Sveta Katarina. The remains of a mighty ancient fortification are still visible at this popular destination for outings. Lake Mola and Lake Klivnik are artificial lakes famous for first-class angling and an excellent starting point for exploring the extremely attractive Burkini. The picturesque hilly landscape with clustered villages on the hilltops is marked by terraced fields and orchards. The sun, air and sharp climate help the local fruit ripen into great quality produce with a wide reputation. The area is the home of traditional brandy distilling and the famous Burkini Plum Brandy. The local cuisine is also extremely varied and attracts throngs of gourmets to the blossoming Burkini fruit route. The traditional Lent parade, Pustje Koshu, dominates events in the Bystritsa region. During Lent, people in towns and villages like to dress up as Shkoromati, driving winter away with bells. Shkoromati are ancient traditional Burkini Lent masks, originating as far back as the 14th century and are considered the oldest Slovenian Lent masks. The traditional farmer's market is an important event where farmers from the wider area present their produce. The European Championship Mountain Speed Race is undoubtedly the most interesting sporting event in the Ilirska Bystrica area. The road between Ilirska Bystrica and Shembie always attracts a mass of visitors who admire the fast driving skills of the best European drivers. There are plenty of reasons to explore the most beautiful places in our municipality. Everyone is sure to find their own inspiring spot. Welcome to the municipality of Ilirska Bystrica.